The Indiana State Police are looking for people who may have seen a deadly crash take place right here on I-69 in Madison County yesterday. It happened around 340 yesterday afternoon near Anderson. Investigators say a car broke through a dividing cable barrier, then went into oncoming traffic, striking a Jeep nearly head on, killing the driver. If you witnessed this crash, you should call Indiana State Police, the Pendleton Post at 1-800-527-4752. Now the crash victim, Lee Ingalls, leaves behind his family and his school family. He was a beloved basketball coach and a teacher at Cowan Jun Junior Senior High School. Our Aaron Cantrell spoke with the Cowan community about Ingalls' legacy. Our motto for the whole time he was here is play hard, play smart, play together. And then every time we'd break down a huddle, we broke down with family on three. Dylan Gaskill is turning to his Cowan Junior Senior High School family to grieve the person who's taught him so much about life. He was more than a coach. He was a, he was a teacher. He was a friend. He was a mentor. To, to his players more than anything, he was a, like another father figure. Coach Ingles was a PE teacher and the coach of the boys varsity basketball team at Cowan Junior Senior High School. He passed away Monday after a crash in Madison County. It's one of those things just completely unbelievable. Principal Patrick Bloom remembers recruiting Ingalls to be a part of the Black Hawks family seven years ago. He went above and beyond in terms of trying to get to know his students. Ingalls will be remembered for his coaching accomplishments. Last year he led our, our boys basketball team to their first sectional championship since 1976. But more importantly, as a man who cared about the people around him. There is no doubt that Coach Ingalls made a difference. The loss of Coach Ingalls will be hard on staff and students. We've taught them that it's okay to cry, it's okay to grieve, it's okay to, to love and hug each other, but at the same time, it's necessary for us to be strong. Because in the end, the community will rebound from this unexpected tragedy and pivot to a place where they can heal and honor his legacy. Coach would have been so proud if he could have seen us all together, like helping each other out and probably the toughest time most of us have seen so far. Reporting in Cowan, Aaron Cantrell, Fox 59 News. Now the school is hosting a candlelight vigil for Coach Ingalls this evening. Students and community members are welcome to attend.